but find the moon crystal to summon the legendary eclipse to cover all the lands. Agreed, dear sister. We can finally be more powerful if the darkness is unleashed. <gasps> oh my! But how do we find that moon crystal? The book's pages don't show its location. You're right. And I thought all we needed was this book. And the spell book, not a map, thank you very much. Silence, you impertinent book. If you rats show me some respect, then maybe I'd help you. How dare you call us rats? A rat? But I thought I was a mouse. So you know where the moon crystal is hidden? Maybe I do, maybe I don't. Why you? Forgive this sister of mine. Ah, shame on you. Her weakened judgment sometimes gets the better of her. This is no way to treat a new member of the family. Family? Hostage is more like it. But now she's seen the light we all have. Yes, we appreciate our new handsome little boy. Little? Oh, no, no, no. I meant medium-sized. But not medium-sized in wisdom and knowledge. That's right. For you can lead us to the moon crystal. Where can we find it? Oh, beautiful leather-bound devil, you. Trust you, you. <laughs> Watch him, Rustacia. Let's go. It, professor it's the roots of your lion staff is what it is roots yes it's roots in the legendary lost continent where it all started the lost continent of magic magic the lions came from those lands and that's how your ancestors were able to form that stuff and infuse it with all the lion powers huh. I've always wondered how it could be so powerful yes but the power of magic also has a dark side to it, Battle Pop. A darkness that is just waiting to escape. Darkness? Yes, the darkness that once, th they say, almost destroyed our world. Can this darkness be defeated? As our king, you would certainly be the one to do it, Paddle Pop. But you would need to discover new powers, greater than your own. Mother! Your Highness. Professor, but these are just legends. With the lion staff, you have certainly protected us in every way possible, my son. Come and see the great Machissimo, Lord of Illusion and Master of Magic. Oh, no, not another phony pretending to do magic. But you have to admit, it's sure fun to watch. Oh, I suppose so. And I bet the guys are down there. I'll catch up with you later, Mother. <laughs> All right, Pat and Pop. And I'll get this to Lena straight away, Professor. See you later. Let him 
out now, Nastisha. He's awful lively. Yes. Why don't you just let me out? <laughs> You've had your fun. Let him stay there, Bristacia. Maybe he'll think twice before mouthing off next time. That must be it! The Star Caves! Ah, uh, but which one is it? It doesn't matter. We'll look through all of them if it takes all year. Search them! <laughs> Maybe the book is playing games with us. Not a thing! Maybe it's gone, Astitia. The crystal must have been moved. Hey, where are we? Why are we stopping? Shh! We're inside the cave. There's nothing to see. Maybe it is gone. Or it could be right under our noses! How dare you enter my home! And a beautiful one it is. But we're not planning to stay long. We're just here to pick up the... Nastisha! The crystal! Take it! Math for dummies! How about a good old book burning, Nastisha? Don't bother. I think you've forgotten that there is something we have to do. Finally. Finally! Stronger already. <laughs> yes, it has begun. Soon, the darkness will be complete. Abracadissimo, sesame hobenissimo, with the powers of the magic of the universe. I order you. I think I know what's going to happen, Lena. Mm-hmm. Me too. Oh, by the way, here's your new modified bow, courtesy of the professor. Modified? Quiet, guys. You're ruining the suspense. 
Release this princess from her earthly bonds. Oh, no! She's done for! But spare her life, be she broken into two! <laughs> yes! Yeah! Woohoo! All right! <laughs> I don't think so, Lena. It's 
so pretty! <laughs> Whoa! Here she comes! Oh. It must be a fairy of some sort! Oh, it's not a fairy! Oh, oh. It is no less than a legend come to life! Oh, a beautiful figure that used to live merely in our imagination! This must be the Star Sorceress! Hmm. She's coming around! Magic Wand, you haven't failed me yet. Brave and true you must be, the one to stop the darkness, the one to save us all. What? But how can I possibly stop this? Who did this? The source of this dark magic was the evil Minotaur King himself, long ago. With his powerful moon crystal, he triggered an eclipse never before seen. An eternal eclipse that plunged our world into an overpowering darkness. But there were those who would not give in to the darkness. And that is when the great battle began. We fought bravely, the forces of good standing side by side, and me fighting side by side with my brother, the Lightning Wizard. It seemed hopeless from the start, but we had to hold on, while my father, the great Unicorn King, forged the Sun Crystal, the ultimate force of light against the darkness, finally arriving with the Sun Crystal. My father sacrificed his life to deliver one final blow. Straight into the moon crystal. Finally, defeating the forces of darkness. And bringing the light back into the world. With his last breath, he left me and my brother with a sacred mission of hiding the two crystals at all costs. Never to see each other again. We departed to the opposite ends of the world, hoping that the forces of evil will never find us. Simple little things. But one of the things I miss the most, Panel Pop, They are beautiful, Mother. But I never missed anything more than you, my son. If there's anything that kept me alive all those years, it was the thought of seeing you again. Those years in Shadow Master's prison. Yes, but here we are, aren't we? Together? But I have to leave again. <sighs> Mother! Those years have taken a terrible toll. The dark powers have a way of destroying you inside. And here it is once more. Fear not, my son. As sure as the light will always find a way to fill the darkness, I will surely see you once again. If the legends are true, it's going to get worse. As the darkness grows, more of these creatures will come. Bigger and deadlier. Our greatest fears are now set in motion, Pedal Pop. You must find my brother and secure the Sun Crystal. 
For that is the only way to stop the darkness. Yes, sorceress. Um, milady? Um, I've been meaning to give this back to you when you've recovered, and, uh, seeing as you've almost... Thank you for your kindness, little one. For catching me. Oh, that? Oh, that's nothing. Since I can't join you in my frail condition, you can keep my magic wand for your journey. May it help you in your mission. And perhaps, help you discover the brave knight within you. Me? A brave knight? Captain, the kingdom? Not to worry, your highness. I will watch over it while you're away. And my mother? I will make sure that she is all right. But hurry. Of course, Captain. Be wary of the witches, for they are stronger than they appear. I suspect that there is a force behind this. Greater than them, and greater than you and me. Time to head to the Great Owl Library. There we should find a map to the Lightly Wizard's whereabouts. But time is the one thing we don't have, Professor. Agreed, Paddle Pop. Agreed. Steady as she goes. It looks like clear skies ahead. All the way to the Owl's ancient library, Professor. Ancient it is. And dangerous. Not many have ventured to go back ever since it was overrun by some kind of monster. Desperate times. Call for desperate measures, exactly, Lena. We need a map to find the Lightning Wizard's castle so we can secure the Sun Crystal. Do you think the library will have that map? If there's any place in the world that would have that kind of map, it would be in the Great Owl Library. Home to the largest collection of maps, painstakingly created and gathered by the ancient owls. I, I'm proud to say. Mm, Should have asked the star sorceress for a few lessons. Huh, this is harder than I thought. Mm. Well, maybe you should start small, Twitch. Take one small bite at a time, I always say. Mm. Talk about you and your small bites. You're making a mess, Spike! S -s -s sorry Oh, but these little ones might just give me some practice. Oh, but d d don't hurt them, Twitch. Don't worry. I'm just going to give them a little makeover. How about a touch of blue? Ooh, wrong color. But it sort of worked. Yeah, not bad, Twitch. One more time. Red, white, and blue! Hmm. Still sending the wrong signals. Um, Twitch? I think she wants a makeover, too. Maybe a regular rainbow would suit her just fine. Whoa. Ah, we're here. Color twitch? I had a little accident with the magic wand, okay? Spike, we just need to make our way through the library. Quietly. Uh, 
Okay, Paddle Pop. This door lies a nest of knowledge, but entering through it will be of utmost challenge. Decide yea or nay you must, but once you touch this door, beware that you may turn to- Dust! This doorknob sure is dusty! Just look for the blue 
green slime wouldn't have looked good on you, Twitch. You're right, Paddle Pop. <sighs> I'll take pink any day. be just a breath away from the inner chambers. If the old stories are true, this must be the last test. The final riddle. Here is the riddle in a nice little package. Six little items to help you find that knowledge. But first, you should be leaning towards finding the beginning. Birds will chase fishes, and the fire will burn bright. But knowledge alone won't let your eyes see the light. You only need to know that solving riddles is an art, for all the answers lie where you can find the... Okay, first you should be leaning towards finding the beginning. Right, the beginning. Hey, this stone's got nothing on it. That must be it. You begin with nothing, right? But what do we do? Step on it? It won't hurt, I guess. Professor. Oh, and I thought we were done with riddles. This is even worse. <clears throat> like trying to find a needle in a haystack. But maybe this can help even the odds. Right. So here's the deal, Magic Wand. We need to find the lightning castle, see? And get the sun crystal or the darkness. That's right. The terrible darkness will rule over the land. And that's no good. We don't want that, do we? Now find me that map. <laughs> you all right, Twitch? <laughs> I'm fine, thanks. 
Hmm. Lightning Castle. Lightning Castle! Thanks a lot. We needed uh. that. And thanks for showing us the way in. We were having trouble with that too. Where is it? Where's the map? There's nothing to see here. Stop right there. That's our map. Oh, we'd really love to chat and get acquainted. But let me introduce you to a new friend instead. She really wants to say hi. Ooh, ooh. The monster! Toodaloo! Bye! <laughs> Run! Go, 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 go! Sense can find the way. Lion Sense. Follow me. Come on! 
Start the Phoenix, Lena! Lion Strike! must also be after the sun crystal. We have to catch up. I saw the path they took, but that can only take us so far. Agreed, Lena. Without that map, there's no way we can find the lightning castle. Wait. You saw the map, right, Twitch? Uh, briefly, yes. Then you can probably still remember it. But I can't read maps, Paddle Pop, and I ain't no navigator. Don't worry, Twitch. You just have to try and remember. Yes. With this general direction and your memory of that map, we can probably triangulate its location. Well, all right, if you say so. What's with all the positive energy around here? Oh, it's just the way we are. Always supporting each other through thick and thin hold and... Hold up, hold up. Okay, I'm about to throw up. Oh, too much happy information. Sorry, Mr. Book. I was just practicing, Lena. Ah! How can you lose it? How hard is it to watch over uh, a little book? I'm sorry, but it was just so fussy. Maybe you should babysit yourself next time, Miss Bossy Britches. Well, maybe I will. Then I won't need you anymore. Are you threaten me? I'll take you to the Witch's High Council if you break our partnership. Girls, come on. We're family. You'd better hold me back, Prestacia, or I'm bound to... <laughs> Why, you pompous rats! Who are you calling a rat? Try to remember what else you saw on that map, Twitch. Well, Professor, I saw a strange curtain of lights right before the castle of the Lightning Wizard. A curtain of lights? A curious description, for sure. I don't see anything that would indicate any type of light source. We're bound to see it, if this is the right direction. Exactly, Lena. We are entering uncharted territory now. Ooh, no one has crossed these oceans in ages. It might be a while before we get any confirmation, Professor. Agreed, Paddle Pop. But I hope it's sooner rather than later. We need that sun crystal desperately. For the legends have spoken of the darkness and the evil creatures that flock to it. Who knows how the kingdom is doing now? Your Highness, you should lie down and rest. I was merely checking on your condition. That is of no importance. <clears throat> How is the kingdom and our citizens? The eclipse continues to grow, slowly. But Paddle Pop should be able to find the sun crystal soon. I hope you're right, Captain. <laughs> that fly is mighty nice, Birdie. Don't you think? It would sure fetch a nice price in the black market. <laughs> I guess so. Afraid of seeing another battle, are you? <laughs> I, your little bird is petrified, Captain. After all, we put it through. <laughs> All right. Poor little treasure tracker. If only you didn't have a nose for the precious stuff. But who cares? <laughs> Yeah. 
Didn't anybody tell you guys that it's not polite to stare? I'm sorry, uh, Mr. Book. I didn't realize that my friend here had a talking book. Oh, I saved Mr. Book from the library, Paddle Pop. Hey, Mr. Champalot, enough with a Mr. Book already. I got a name, you know. Oh? I'm the Book of Malice, if you please. Oh, uh, that's not a very nice name. Quite appropriate, if you ask me, considering the attitude. Well, um, oh, m m m m m maybe I'll just call you Mal then. Oh, yeah, Mal, that's got a nice ring to it. Let's go for it, Lena. Roger that, Paddle Pop. The Blind Elders must be crazy, Captain. They're going straight for the lightning death traps. Hey, that's exactly where I want them. Oh, my goodness. What now? Another vessel with weapons! <gasps> Pirates! 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 Sweetie! 
castle was awesome. We really must be in the magical land. Wizard. Oh, why does it have to end in fighting, oh handsome wizard? Haven't you heard of a good negotiation? A nice bargain. The sun crystal for your life! <laughs> Together, sisters! Of course, the wizard doesn't know I'm on his side.
Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! <laughs> Yikes! I'm not waiting for that explosion! Hey, watch it! Watch the pages! <gasps> oh, uh, sorry, Mel! <laughs> The Phoenix served us well, Lena. I wish we could have saved it. I know, Professor. But maybe we can yet save another bird! I've got you, little bird. You're safe now. Time's a wasting, Lena. Battle Pop's waiting. <laughs> Say this to a porcupine, but hug me a little tighter, if you please. We're almost there, little buddy. Hang in there. <laughs> no worries. We're all right. Right? My apologies for mistaking you as an enemy. Of course. I have not seen a friend inside these walls for as long as I can remember. The protection of the Sun Crystal has been my only endeavor. Paddle Pop! Well, you're among friends now. Oh, oh. If I may respectfully venture a guess, would that be the sun crystal adorning your neck? You would be right, wise owl, but only partly correct. For this is but a third of the sun crystal. A third? You mean there are two other pieces? Yes. I know that you probably seek the sun crystal in its entirety, for I have seen the darkness growing again from afar. But we were told that you had rescued the sun crystal whole. I was the only one who saw it. The clash was an event too great for the Sun Crystal, and it was shattered into three pieces, onto three distant paths, and I was able to save only one. I had kept this knowledge a secret, for if the other pieces fell into evil hands, they would most certainly destroy it, and we would have no hope on a day such as this. But if the Sun Crystal is broken in three pieces, how can we stop the darkness? The Sun Crystal was forged once by my father. And it can be forged again. Keep this piece in your possession, for I grow weak. 
It took most of my magic to defeat the witches. You can travel to our kingdom. You'll be safe there. I have sworn that I would find those lost pieces when the day of reckoning arrives. And that day has come. You will help us? The pieces of the crystal must have gone to the brightest places, attracted by the other forces of light. I will travel to the west to find one, and the rest of you brave souls can travel to the bright places in the east. Your guide bird here can lead you there. I will meet you at the Sun Temple in the south to forge the pieces together. Is it me, or is this old wizard heading straight to disaster? Mal? No crystal, no strength. Walking all the way to the east on foot sounds like a death wish to me. The book is correct. Perhaps you could use some assistance? Oh, uh, m m maybe we can go with you, Mr. Wizard. Uh, my, my friend here seems to know a lot about your world. I'm sure together uh, we can help. Uh, uh, wait, wait, um, uh... Yeah, me too! We can go with you! Give you some added muscle! Wait, Spike, Twitch, you don't have to do this. Maybe we can, um... Two, every night. His own strength. His own mission. With duty fulfilled, a mighty force, united with his brothers. I, I, uh, I uh, would be honored to be in your brave company. Uh, Mal? I, I, uh, uh, well, all right. Thanks, Mal. Are you sure you want to do this, guys? On your own? Without us? Uh, oh, well, we are going with Mal and the kind wizard. And I've got my magic wand. Nothing's gonna stop us. We need those pieces of the crystal, don't we? Just make sure you get to that sun temple, all right? Okay, Paddle Pop, promise. The darkness grows quickly, my friends. Then we must hurry. Take care, guys. We'll see you soon. G goodbye, Paddle Pop. Usual. This is unacceptable! We have failed once again! But they used the very crystal against us, Nestisha. And it's powerful! That is why you need to destroy it! It is the ultimate power of light against my darkness! <gasps> Your darkness, Nestisha? We have to get that sun crystal and destroy it. That's all we need to do. But the crystal itself is not complete! I saw it. What they have is merely a piece of it. Then the lion must be searching for the other pieces. That is why they continue to search. <laughs> and we only need to follow. You really have done this before, haven't you? Shown the way? I have, yes. Like the other guide birds. But it seems that all I do is lead the way. For as long as I can remember. The pirates. And how they forced you to find their treasures. Yes. But sometimes they got angry. Angry? Sometimes I didn't lead them to the treasures. At least not the kinds that they were looking for. Well, you're with us now. And no one's going to get angry. All right, little buddy? Sunny. Sunny? Yes, my name. Oh, of course. Nice to meet you, Sunny. Are you sure you can't reach the kingdom with your device, Professor? Oh, I've tried, Paddle Pop. It's no use. The lands of magic must have an atmosphere all its own, receptive to its own signals, normal though the skies may look. I hope everything is all right. Your mother, the queen, is going to be fine. They will surely look after her in the kingdom. 
You should concern yourself with the task at hand, Pop. Or there might not be a world, let alone a kingdom, to go home to. Right, Professor. A little bit closer. Ah, now see, kid. You know what I want to see. Ooh, I smell new powers for me. Awesome! Oh, it's just a bug. New powers for me. New powers for me. Oh, great. More toys for the little brat. Now somebody go help our new guests. I think they're about to get lost. Huh? Mm -hmm. We'll do it, Prince Bolo. Abu Buliba, Abu Buliba, you're, you're the greatest. greatest. You're the greatest. <laughs> At least we get to spend some time away from his royal highness. Come on. This feels different. Volunteering on our own dangerous mission. Tell me again why I agreed to do this. B -b because you're a brave and honorable book. And together, we can find the missing pieces of the sun crystal. I don't think brave and honorable are part of his index, Spike. Hey, I heard that, you slimy lizard. At a time of great danger. The true knights of a kingdom are to honor each other with respect. Mm. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness is right. Looks like someone had a little too much fun with the garden shears. Huh? <gasps> Lion strike! I can't stop it! Oh, it's a trap! What do we do? They just keep coming! Uh, there's no need to do that, Paddle Pop! It's a maze, is what it is! A massive one at that! Can you get us out, Professor? We have to hurry! It's going to take some doing! But maybe with both us birds scouting the way? Eh? Mm, no problem! That's the spirit, little one! Here we go! This is taking too long, Lena. The eclipse is growing. I know, Paddle Pop. Let's hope we get through this soon. Did I hear somebody looking for a way to get through this maze? <laughs> and soon? Well, look no further, as we are here to assist you. Courtesy of Prince Bolo. Yes. You have all been invited to bask in the glory of his absence. Uh, nuisance. Uh, presence. The glory of his presence. Um, actually, we need to get going. And this maze is slowing us down. I don't think we have time to meet anybody. What's taking so long? So you refuse to meet our great and loving leader, Prince Bolo? With all due respect, yes. We're kind of in a hurry. So you do refuse to meet our leader. Uh-huh. We really can't stay. Huh? Uh, wrong answer! Professor! Uh, are you doing to uh, 
boss! Uh, uh, not exactly the best way to beat royalty! Maybe this is their way of making us bow and curtsy! Uh, 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 now it doesn't bother me the least that you didn't want to meet me! The high prince and ruler of this beautifully sculptured forest. Mangled forest is more like it. Well, it will be beautiful. But it does bother me that you wouldn't leave a gift of some sort. A token, if you will. We don't have time for this, and we have no treasures to offer you. Oh, but it's not treasures I seek. Hey! Hey! That's my bow! Ah! Very nice. <laughs> very, very nice. <laughs> Maybe these new powers can help me make the forest beautiful. Just like I want it to be. Uh, uh, you can't do this. <laughs> right. And I also can't do this. Huh? <gasps> for the rest of their lives! <laughs> Lena! What is... Of this let us down i'm sorry for the suddenness and haste we just had to rescue who we can oh, that should hold it yes those friends of yours the lions they were too big for us to carry i hope that they are all right well of course but what exactly is it you're trying to save us from is it from this prince is he even dangerous dangerous he is and he's not just the prince He's our son. Useless piece of junk! Why is it not working? It's supposed to be glowing! Another piece of junk! On bananas. It all began when he started training with us. Training? Yes, even the prince had to undergo training. We were all supposed to be learning how to take care of the forest, just like the elders, when it was all still beautiful. They were teaching us how to use the magical tools that can shape the forest. We had to start with the simple tools, of course, but the prince couldn't wait. No one could make him wait patiently. Not even his mother! But one day, he found a way. Yes, the queen had a powerful tool that could capture the very essence of a flower and spread it everywhere. But Bolo had other plans for it. He used it to steal the power of all the other tools to create an all-powerful one. But he was terrible at shaping the forest. Yes, but he never stopped. And we were all forced to live in this, his horrible garden. <laughs> I can't believe my child would do this to us. If only I had kept it safe, then maybe... Hush, it's not your fault. The lure of power is as old as history itself. But hopefully... 
We can find a way to bring him back. I agree. It seems that the power has corrupted his heart. If we can take away this power, then perhaps we can also restore the child that you once knew. But his power is great. That is why we had to escape. We couldn't control him anymore. I don't know how we can stop him. Leave that to my friends. But we need a way to get close to your son first. Surely he'll be on guard against any attack. Ah, oh, this blasted thing. If only it worked when I needed to. <gasps> I think we just found the way. I could be wrong, but I'd swear your tools still have some power left in them. Right, Paddle Pop. I see some signs of magic. If there's any magic left, it won't be much. Prison guards, status check. <coughs> Prisoners still in captivity. No signs of escape or any plotting to escape. <laughs> Sorry. If all of you use the tools together, with whatever magic's left in them, that it might just be enough to stop him. But how do we get the tools out? We're not supposed to climb anywhere near it. Who said anything about climbing? One, Paddle Pop. Maybe we can get out of here first. Right, Lena. I'd know that sound anywhere. What's that noise? Sounds like new powers for me! Lands, eager to hear from you and your wisdom. Ah, oh, now listen. Ah, very nice. Your Highness, Your Highness, are you there? Well, yes. The evil eclipse is still growing, Your Highness. The darkness grows in the Lion Kingdom. Lion Kingdom? What is this? Release the bug. Somebody's going to pay for this! Thanks, Sonny! Go, Lena!
Avenge us again! Lena? Mr. Wizard, D do you suppose that's Paddle Pop? It could most certainly be. When do you think we'll see him again? If we are to save our world, then it must be soon, my friend. Soon. Before it's too late. Any mountain, no matter how tall, can be climbed step by step by anyone, no matter how small. I guess we should follow, Spike. It's a little bit steep, Twitch. Yeah, with a thorny ending to boat. Isn't he going to help us? Obviously not. Maybe they don't do that type of thing here. You know, helping. Oh! Never mind. Let me carry the book for you. Keep your clammy hands off me, you reptile! Never in a million years! But, 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 Mal, it's only till we get down there. Yeah, don't worry. The feeling is mutual. Hmm. Huh. Talk about your crusty hardcovers. <laughs> Slowly, Spike, <laughs> and don't look down. Oh, okay, Twi. <laughs> Spike. <laughs> what? <laughs> Read the spell, lizard. <laughs> A 
around every corner did we falter, and every step we did blunder. Save us from all asunder! That is one big step, my friend. Oh, <laughs> yeah. For your information, that spell is reserved for friends only. Yeah, for your information, that spell is reserved for friends only! My beautiful pages! Um, uh, uh, thank you for, um... Uh, don't worry. I've had lots of practice with spikes, if you know what I mean. Ah, of course. No, fearless navigator, how is it exactly that you know where the pieces of the sun crystal are? I don't know, Professor. To tell you the truth, I just always seem to find the brightest things. Somehow I'm attracted to them. Ah, a mystery. But I'm glad you can guide us along with your mysterious but wonderful gift. Thanks, Professor. I hope Spike and Switch are finding their way all right. Not having a guide bird and all. They'll find their way. I'm sure they're up to the task. You're probably right, Lena. Your little soldiers sure look brave, Mother. Right in the heart of the enemy. Are you sure you want to do that? Mind your own strategy, Paddle Pop. Is that what the professor taught you? Playing mind games with the opponent? No mind games, Mother. <laughs> Just superior strategy. <laughs> Superior, is it? Well, let me tell you, small though these soldiers may be, and their steps tiny, but they are the same ones that will give me a victory. Huh. How did you do that? The same way I beat you all the other times, Paddle Pop. With superior strategy. <laughs> Would you like me to teach you? <laughs> sure, Mother. Sure. They'll be fine, Paddle Pop. <sighs> I know. Oh, oh. I think we've arrived. You gave us quite a scare back there, Nastisha. All that about your darkness? This is unacceptable! We have failed once again! But they used the very crystal against us, Nestisha. And it's powerful! That is why you need to destroy it! It is the ultimate power of light against my darkness! <sighs> your darkness, Nestisha? The Sun Crystal is the ultimate power of light against the Master's dark powers. That is why we need to destroy it. M -m master What master are you talking about, Nastisha? It is you we follow, do we not? As the Eclipse grows larger and the land darker, the Master grows stronger too. And when he is finally strong enough, he will join us and lead us to our great dark destiny. It sure is an odd place to put statues. Oh, in odd poses, too, Lena. Very unseemly. It's kind of beautiful, though. They're diamonds. Yes, honey, diamonds. But from the looks of it, I'd swear they look just like knights, Paddle Pop. Right, Professor. Knights turn into diamonds. Is that possible? Apparently so, Lena. Oh, but who would do such a thing? <gasps> oh. 
The answer must be in there, Professor. That's it. In you go. Straight into the heart of danger. But, but, but what's in there, Nastasia? Are they going to get another piece of the crystal? The second piece of the crystal probably is in there. But they're going to find something nasty first. <laughs> Nothing you'd want to see, for sure. <laughs> oh, but it will. See them. <laughs> There's more of them, as if fighting a battle frozen in time. Sunny, isn't this the right place? Yes, I'm sure of it, but I have a bad feeling about it. Diamond statues, snakes, <laughs> and more snakes, and eyes. What could this all mean? Diamond statues. Snakes and eyes. Think, you old owl, think. Paddle Pop. The kingdom. See the captain! <laughs> Your Highness! What are you doing? I must help them! It is madness down there! You must stay in bed, Your Highness! You, you are in no condition to... <gasps> Mother! Paddle Pop! I figured it out! What do you mean, Professor? Diamond statues, snakes, and eyes! This must be the lair of the legendary Snake Heller! Snake Heller? A ruthless, legendary creature with the power to turn anybody into diamonds! Forever! Exactly! The monster can turn you into diamonds forever! If you look into her eyes, that's what happened to these knights! Nice to see some uninvited guests. I was just starting to get lonely. Run! From. Okay, Paddle Pop. Just stay close to me. Eyes closed. Eyes closed, right. Come out! Lion strike! <laughs> I was just starting to miss you, Lion! <laughs> huh? Getting smart, are you? Arrows, Lena! To hold 
creatures! This will not stop me! Ah! Get the crystal, Lena! I'll keep her occupied! Okay, Pat Pop! Lena, the second piece of the crystal. They're back. <gasps> there you are. Are you all right? Oh, my. Paddle Pop. Diamonds may be a girl's best friend, but surely not for an owl like me. The crystal piece must have been attracted to the diamonds and the brightness. Right, Sonny. Paddle Pop.
Brave knights, you have succeeded where all of us could not, and rid the land of the monster's stare and its venom within. For that, we honor you. Our kingdoms will rejoice upon hearing of your noble deed. We must return at once. All these knights, together, couldn't defeat the monster? From the looks of it, one from each kingdom tried and failed. Maybe they shouldn't have come here alone. Good point, Lena. The benefits of teamwork can never be emphasized enough. Unfortunately, I wasn't much help. That's all right, Professor. Without you, we wouldn't have known how... Not to look a legendary snake monster in the eye? <laughs> <laughs> right, Professor. The good news is there's only one more piece of the crystal left. But whether the lightning wizard has found it or not, we can only guess. There's still time for us to search for the last piece. We will search until the darkness won't let us. We can't give up. Ow! sure you don't have any spells to help us through this, Mal? It's awful thick. <laughs> yeah, Mal. Some help here? <sighs> oh, these leaves are annoying. I guess I can try to summon some help. Oh, oh my. Read it, my friend. Well, don't blame me for the kind of help you get. It's what you would call uh, oh, uh, a risky enterprise. Uh, well, okay. <laughs> Here goes. Uh, f f from earth or sky, we apply for help in times awry. M m make haste the hands of magic to avert a course that's tragic. Oh, that's one heavy spell. Just to clear some brush. Switch. Cute ones, yeah. But no help at all. Help comes in many forms, and not always in the manner you seek. They're building something, Twitch. Yeah. Little construction fairies. All they need now are little hard hats. I it's so beautiful. It appears that the help we seek lies right through those doors. What's inside? Patience, my friend. It's a place for the departed. The departed are supposed to help us? How's that possible? They're dead! What's inside? Patience, my friend. It's a place for the departed. The departed are supposed to help us? How's that possible? They're dead! The dead are wiser. And closer than you think. Huh? Um, m m Mr. Wizard? Aren't these the White Knights? The ones I saw on the walls of your castle? Yes, they are. Immortalized here with honor. The brave companions of my father, the Unicorn King. And there were little ones too? My friend, 
It is neither size, strength, nor shining armor that makes a noble knight. No? The true knights of this and all the other lands are those who bravely seek to do the right thing, regardless of size, stature, or origin. The true knights are those who risk their own lives for the lives of those around them. Under different circumstances, I would consider this a success, Paddle Pop, finding the second piece of the sun crystal, but seeing the troubles back in the kingdom, oh, it shakes me to my core. I know, Professor. The darkness has grown and brought more of those dark monsters along with it. Oh, God forbid what is yet to come. Yet to come, Professor? The Dark Army. Yes, if the legends are true, and so far they have been, along with the darkness comes that same dark army, the only force that once almost defeated the light. It's dark? Why is it so dark? That's because you're blind, you sightless rodent. We all are. Ooh, that, that's right. <laughs> Watch where you're going. My goodness, how will we ever find our way? Ow! Oh, oh! Yes, if only we had eyes that could see. Or some good friends who could help us. Some kind souls to lead us home. Looks like they need a helping hand. And someone to show them the way. The world is a mean and cruel place. We are on our own yet again. Will no one come to the aid of three blind boys in dire need of assistance? Let's see if we can help. I guess we're on our own. Yes, not one kind soul to help us. Not one? Really? Um, hello? You needed some help? Ah, finally! Someone to help us! Yes, a few beautiful souls! Oh, um, uh... You don't know how long we've been trying to find our way home! It's been ages! Where is it exactly that you need to go? Uh, oh, uh, um, we are, uh, headed to, uh, um, uh, uh, over the hill, just yonder hill. Um, uh, any one of those hills, actually, seeing as we, uh, can't see. Oh, yes, yes, J just yonder hill. I guess it's not too far, right, Paddle Pop? I guess we can lead you there. Wonderful! On our way, then! Ah, <laughs> uh, sir? Uh, not to rush you or anything. But shouldn't we be going, a uh, growing eclipse and all? The only ones that have seen the eclipse and its deadly consequences, besides me and the sorceress, were the White Knights. Somehow, I was hoping that they would give me a sign. A sign, sir? Yes, a sign that there is still hope. Spike! Come on! Oh, oh no! Oh, oh. Huh? 
all know is correct. These are sacred statues. <laughs> Spike! Nearly there, guys. That's right. We're almost home. Oh, how I've missed it. Easy now. A few more steps. Right, almost. Oh, thank you. Whoa. Don't thank us yet. It's just another hill. Oh, we're so sorry. It's been ages since we've gone home. We must have forgotten. I forgot that there was one more hill. Oh, my. Yes. Pardon our mistake. We're such forgetful creatures. Oh, that's, uh, okay. You're not leaving us, are you? Please, stay with us. Yes, it will never be the same without you. Oh, we, we, we were just starting to enjoy your c company. D d don't leave us. Right. Don't worry. We had no intention of leaving you. Ah! Oh, what's wrong, miss? Take it easy. Oh, nothing's wrong. I, I just forgot something. Oh, what did you forget? Tell me, sister. The power of the sun crystal is too strong for the master. I cannot draw near it. What master is this that you keep talking about? I will just retrieve that which I forgot. And I will catch up with you later, dear friends. Wonderful. Really? Uh, are you really coming back? Lead them to the monster's lair and get that crystal. We can't fail again. Well, all right then. Here I go. Safe passage. Until I see you all again. Well, she seems all right. Yeah, I guess. All's well that ends well, don't you think? Home sweet home awaits. Crystal's power is strong. Yes, the Sun Crystal is almost complete and it gains strength. If all its pieces are forged again together, it can destroy me. But we have the power of darkness on our side. The eclipse grows, and I grow stronger along with it. When you see the darkness reach the highest peaks, then my strength will be sufficient, and I can be free once again! <laughs>
Um, we really need to get going. No, no, no. I'm having none of that. Don't leave yet. Oh, oh it's going to be good. I'm sure of it. Yes. Just perfect for these kind souls who helped us. Uh, I bet this is delicious. <laughs> oh, mind your manners, sister. Serve the guests before yourself. Oh, oh of, of course. So sorry. Actually, that's all right. Because we really should be going. Nonsense. You should have a little soup before you go. A little sustenance for your long journey. No, I really think we should. You wouldn't want to disappoint an old blind mouse, would you? It does smell good. This is my pride and joy, after all. An old secret recipe. Indulge me one last time. Okay. Oh, I've got one. Oh, you've got one already. I guess this would be mine. Right. to really know us, it's time for you to meet our really hungry friend. If you will. Appetizer? Appetizer! Uh, yes! Big meals tend to give it indigestion! Sensitive stomach and all! Rustacia! Oh, sorry! T too much information! Cattle paw! Appetizer! Small bites! Me! Hide, Lita! I'll hold it back! insurance in case they come after us. Oh, but the monster should keep them busy. And the soup. You did put in enough of that potion like I told you to. Y yes, a, a spoonful. Just like the salt. A spoonful? <laughs> yes. But a spoonful of the potion is not gonna last. <laughs> I wish this monster was more your size, Lena. Oh, that's not a bad idea. 
Mickey if we could only get the monster to drink this soup. It doesn't want the soup, Professor. It wants me. <laughs> Lena. Keep up the shrinking spell! It's going to quickly wear off! Ah! No! Ah! Ganusha, the crystals! There is something strange with that bird, Bristration. Something really strange. We have to get out of here! Uh, but, but, but the crystals! You're back. Uh, the potion must only be temporary. Just enough to keep us occupied. Poor little fella. Poor little fella? It almost swallowed you whole. I know, but I think it's just a little hungry. <gasps> Speaking of little, where's Sunny? We have to... There you are! How'd you get these back? Actually, I don't know. The brightness... It happened so quickly. Well, we better get a move on before that monster decides to grow again. Well, maybe that's not such a bad idea. Whoa. 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 Not a bad idea? <sighs> Lena? Not so hungry now, are you? Now, we just need a little ride, okay? Well, first class transportation in the magical lands. Who'd have known? Thanks, Lena. You're welcome, Professor. Hmm. Maybe I should charge a little transportation fee? Especially for jungle lions. You know what, Lena? What? I think I liked you better when you were tiny. Ha ha. Very funny. Do you think the wizard knows where we're going, Spike? Seems like an awful lot of walking to me. He is one quiet wizard, that's for sure. Oh, I wouldn't worry about it, guys. I'm, I'm sure the great wizard won't lead us into any danger. Great wizard, it is me, huh. brother. And the rest of the White Knights are here, at your service. So I see. The eclipse was starting to rouse us from our eternal sleep. And your companion finally woke us up with his timely disturbance. Oh, this is sorry. I assume you could use some assistance? Like times past? Your assistance is most welcome. Nastisha? Nastisha? 
Nastisha, we're back. She's not here. Oh, but, but where else could she be? But, but, but here, at home. We have to find her. <gasps> there she is! At the lair of the Minotaur King! Huh? Well, what is she doing there? It, it is forbidden to even go n n near it! The dark powers are strongest there. It is the birthplace of the Moon Crystal after all! Nastisha needs more dark powers? I is that why she's there? We'll find out soon enough. Are we close, Sunny? I'm not sure, Lena, but this feels like the right way. Fair enough. Oh, I don't know how he does it, but he's been right so far every single time. Yes, it's uncanny, Professor. Oh, sheep! Oh, sheep? been here before! The Sheep Village! It's beautiful here, Paddle Pop! Right, Lena. It's almost as if nothing's... wrong. Oh, the eclipse is growing faster than I expected, Paddle Pop. Troubling, for sure. the darkness, Lena. I know. We understand. Thanks for the ride, and we'll see you later, okay? Maybe it's smarter than we are. Huh? <gasps> Wolves! Lena, we have to help them. They too fast, Sophia. Don't stop, little brother. Run! Sophia, ah! this is it. Let's go. Inside the darkness. We have. 
have to try, Father. We have to go in there and save them. You don't know if it's safe, Koyun. You don't even know where they are. Ovia and her brother could be anywhere in the forest. But we can't abandon them. And if this lion survived after going into the darkness, why can't we go in there and help them? We can't ignore the legends, Koyun. The legends of our past, not the lions. What do the legends say? Why can't you go into the darkness? The legends spoke of the day when the darkness was unleashed in our village. A darkness that none of our ancestors had ever seen before. It crept across the village, and one by one, our ancestors started to disappear. At the same time, the wolves came, terrorizing the village. But the light finally came back and banished the shadows, and we never saw the wolves again. Until now. The message that's been handed down through the generations is a message of warning. Yes, we know, Father. They said we can't go into the darkness. It's far too dangerous, yes, but we have to try. We can't abandon them like this. Please understand, Father. All of you, please, we have to. <sighs> if only I had saved them. We can go into the darkness and find out what happened to them. And if it's not too late, we will bring them back. You've already lost too many from your tribe. If the darkness can't hurt us lions, then we should be the ones to go. I will go with you. The eclipse is growing as we speak, and this mission is going to take valuable time. I know, Professor, but we have to try. You and Sonny, try your best to protect the village, and we'll come back as soon as we can. All right, Battle Pop. I'm sure we can find her on our own, Koyun. We can follow the wolf tracks to their den. I can't stay here and do nothing. And I know this forest. I might be able to help. All right. end here, but there's no sign of the wolves. They could be even deeper in the forest, Paddle Pop. No, I'm sure they're not too far. They've been attacking us constantly. I see more tracks. Follow me. The wolves will be back soon. Their attacks come like clockwork, sudden and swift. Ooh. They are certainly fierce and efficient. And they cannot be defeated. You can distract them momentarily, but they have no weakness. <laughs> you can't even go in there to find them. Yes, the darkness. It is a sanctuary. Sanctuary? Professor? If what you say is true, and they cannot be defeated, then why would they need this sanctuary unless... I think... 
think I found their weakness. The tracks lead straight to that cave. I see it. Perfect place. <gasps> Wolves! Huh? Do they know we're here? No. It looks like they're getting ready for something. The village. Good luck, Professor. We're counting on you. I hope Sonny and the Professor are ready, because we need to check out that cave. Don't think all the wolves are gone. There's more of them, for sure. We've seen them. If I go alone, it'll be easier to slip through. Battle Pop! Don't worry, Lena. If I find them, you and Koyun might need to cover our escape. Okay, Battle Pop. Dream on. Just like your father's clothes. You're right. No one has ever come back from the darkness? Not even one. Once they crossed over, that was it. There was no sign of them. If none of the sheep ever came back from the darkness, and all you see in return are more and more wolves. <gasps> then you must be... <gasps> Are you sure about this, old owl? We are surely more vulnerable out in the open. Whew. I may certainly be wrong, but at some point we have to find a way to fight back. And I think this is our best chance. Please, we have to work together. When the wolves come... They're here! Remember, honey, it's you and me now. Okay, Professor. Now, one more thing, my friend. Whoever you are! 
I'm with Koyun. We're here to get you out. <gasps> Koyun? But he shouldn't be here. He will turn into a wolf like us. Lena. <gasps> you. You're. You're a wolf. All. All the sheep are turning into wolves. Now I'm sure Ovia is still alive. She hasn't been gone long. We have to find her. Oh, of course. Another one. No, Sunny.
We have to get away from the wolves. There are too few of us to risk staying in the village any longer. Of course. You must travel to a safe place. We'll find a way to stop the darkness. Then all the lands will be safe again. Stacia, that's what worries me. of our future lord and master! is complete. My powers will be stronger than they have ever been. Powers enough to conquer all these lands and the rest of the universe! <laughs> Sure is one busy village. No doubt a major port in these parts? That's right, Professor. Most of the ships come here to dock, as it's one of the brightest places, thanks to the... Thanks to the what, Sunny? It almost feels like home, Paddle Pop. Back in the Lion Kingdom. I know, Lena. It does. I wish I was there. You must have missed this, Mother. Being around all the lions. Oh, I certainly did, Paddle Pop. Welcome to the festival, Your Highness! <laughs> Thank you. Enjoy yourselves! There, up ahead! Dance with what? your mother. <gasps> Making up for lost time sure is fun, isn't it? Yes, it sure is, mother.
We should do this more, Mother. I know, Paddle Pop. But I think you need more practice. What? Paddle Pop? My mother and I, we've already lost so much time. I can't bear the thought of losing more. We have to stop the darkness, Lena. So we can finally go home. We have to find that last piece of the sun crystal. Right. Paddle Pop, we have a small problem. The beam of light has always been one of the brightest places in the land. And there's two of them, isn't that right, Sunny? One here in the east and... Yes, one in the west. piece of the crystal might be here. But between us and that beam of light is a considerably large body of water, hmm? called the ocean. Right. It's pretty far. Hold on, guys. I think I just found a way. Or should I say, I found our weasel. Looks like the light is fading, Mr. Wizard. It looks like the only light around here. That it is. It has always been one of the brightest places in the land. A magical source of light. But now, the darkness threatens it all. We have to hurry. Mm. Uh. Uh, m master w what about the sun crystal? We have failed to destroy any piece of it. We will find the last piece before Paddle Pop, and we will destroy it. But, master, how can you draw near it? The sun crystal can destroy you. Along with the growing darkness, there is a power that can provide me with strength against the sun crystal. A power that I can finally wield. Huh? The moon crystal? But we've already triggered the eclipse. <laughs> the moon crystal has powers beyond that. Especially in the hands of a master. A master of darkness. Well, guess who it is? Huh? Our old neighborhood pirate. Ah, the last who defeated me and almost destroyed me ship. That would be the same one, yes. Huh? And Bernie! You're the ones who stole me bad, me guy to the treasures. I missed him. His name is Sonny, in case you ever bothered to ask. And he is not your bird anymore. What do you want, Hermie? Me ship is barely put together as it is. Do you want that too? Well, that's exactly what we need. Yep. We need your ship to find something. Sounds important and valuable. Is there anything in it for me? No, you're not getting anything. You're just taking us there, understand? Uh... I've heard of the legends, but I never thought it was here in the beam. That's the Dragon of the East. The Dragon of the West. Oh, oh my. Fancy that. More danger. At least it looks like the dragon's sleeping. But its treasure sure looks alive to me. If the piece of the sun crystal is here, it would be within those treasures. The dragon would surely sense any intrusion, Great Wizard. Any attempt would seem foolish. Tell me again why we're in here. Could we be the foolish ones? N -n no, it's because we're small and attract less attention. Right, we are the foolish ones. Talk about your treasure troves. This sure takes the cake. C -c 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 
cake, Twitch? Don't tell me you're hungry again, Spike. Well, sort of. Sorry. Well, maybe you're in luck. Scrambled, hard-boiled, or sunny side up. W what, Twitch? Dragon's egg up ahead. Yo-ho-ho! -ho. The loot of a thousand pirate ships. I be storming the fort straight away, if not for that dragon. You must have been swimming in the bilge and looking for Davy Jones's locker. This is madness. Not even a pirate like me would dare to steal a dragon's treasures. You're not going to weasel out now, are you, Captain Weasel? Nay. I'd rather face a dragon's wrath than that of a beautiful lady. Good. Lena? Yes, Sonny? I, I know the brightness led us here, but it feels different this time. Don't worry. If it's there, we'll find it. And hopefully, before the dragon wakes up, Lena. Right, Professor. This is going to take forever. Sunny? There are other crystals here too, Battle Pop. Right, Sonny. But not the one we need. <laughs> Lena? <laughs> Lena? Yes? I thought something happened to you. The lion sense was trying to... Paddle Pop? I think the lion sense was right! The dragon captain! Cannons! Is it me? Or is the treasure kinda... warm? Uh, uh, I think you're right. Whoa! Whoops! Huh. You all right, Spike? Hey! Get me out! It's hot in here! Uh, uh, oh, on second thought, it's actually quite nice. Mm, ah, just like a spa. Um, uh, I think I found something, Twitch. <laughs> huh. Attaboy, Spike. Mm, that's one warm crystal. T -t Twitch, uh, I think the treasure is getting... Cold? Bright. And so is that egg. Yes, the egg does look a little cold now. The crystal must have been keeping it warm. No crystal. Cold dragon egg. I think something's about to get really angry. Ah! Ah! Engage the dragon. <laughs> we had the crystal, but now we got an egg problem. An egg problem? Uh, th there was an egg floating on top of the treasure, and the crystal was right below it. The dragon must have been using that crystal to keep the egg warm. That's why it's angry. Oh, should we give the crystal back? No.
the most precious thing. It will risk everything to protect it. You and your child are now freed from the constraints of this dying light. Let your infant come into this world far from the darkness, pure and unblemished by its evil. But remember this favor I have given you this day, for I might have need of your assistance on another. Mr. Wizard? That must be the last piece of the crystal. Yeah! Thank you! A Dark Lord! We were looking for that crystal! Cause we need to destroy it! We have never backed down from any Dark Lord before! And we're not backing down now! Give me the crystal! Spike, Twitch, but what happened to you guys? Yes, Woo. what a wonderful surprise. How did you get here? Nice to see you, Professor. We were sort of, uh, saved. Saved, Twitch? The Lightning Wizard. He sent us back here before they disappeared. Disappeared? Yes, uh, along with the White Knights. They all disappeared when the Shadow Master attacked us. <gasps> Shadow Master? Yeah, Lena, we saw him. He's 
and he wants to destroy the crystal! <gasps> the last piece of the crystal! I thought we had taken care of Shadow Master. I should have known he was behind all this. And the Sun Crystal is probably the only thing that can stop him. That's why he's trying to destroy it. Then we'd better hurry and forge the Sun Crystal, Paddle Pop. The growing eclipse can only help Shadow Master get stronger. <clears throat> I have never been one to join any noble missions, sir. But uh, I would like to join you, seeing as the darkness is a danger to everyone. Even to a nasty old pirate like me, that is, if you see me fit enough to do so. Unfortunately, me ship has seen its best days. Its days are not over yet, Captain, and you're welcome to help us save our world. Now that we have all the pieces of the Sun Crystal, you're going to take us to the Sun Temple. There, we can forge the Sun Crystal whole again, in the fire of the Eternal Flame. Then we can finally stop the darkness. Pop has not returned, Your Highness, but the dark creatures will take over the whole capital soon. Guide all the lions to the High Fortress. It's our only hope. Yes, Your Highness. <sighs> They're inside the walls of the castle. Let's go. ship runs on coal? Aye, a magical kind of coal, to be exact. Highly explosive. Just the kind I like. <laughs> Captain, I don't think we be surviving this foolish journey of yours, not even with double the dickens. You be turning on me then, you lily livered. That we are, Captain. We're sick of this danger. We believe in you. Effective. Immediately. Serve thee well. I'll be danged. Me own matey's leaving me to ply the sweet trade alone. Maybe it's time you found some new friends. The ones that don't leave you behind? You be one wise lass, Miss Lena. And then some. What are we doing here? We were supposed to go to the Sun Temple. Why? But we be low on fuel. 
and just over yonder is the town of the ogres, sellers of the magical coal. It looks like they're doing something more than selling. What's happening? Th th those scary creatures are stealing stuff, Professor. Emphasis on scary? Right. They're trolls. But they be living underground in the darkness. The only light their eyes can bear. But with the darkness taking hold, looks like they've decided to come out. Then come out with a vengeance they have. Stealing the ogre's treasures. Treasures! I still have a bit of treasure in me ship! Hey! Hey! You and the Professor help the Captain, Lena. Protect the ship, or we'll never get to the Sun Temple. Right, Paddle Pop. Come on, Professor! I'm sorry there, uh, Lion. Uh, you're kind of in the way of chaos over here. Yeah, we noticed that. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to run for my life now. Wait, we need some coal. The kind that, um, explodes. Is there another kind? It's down in the mines, of course. Wait, what mines? Those mines. Okay. Are we supposed to see something? It's an underground mine, don't you get it? Ah! Question is, how do we get down there? <laughs> Looks like we found our entrance! Come on! with a little bit of coal dust can give us just enough torque differential to cash out acceptable elevation. Um, in English, Professor? Aye, your friend there thinks he can get me ship going. For a short time, that is, Lena. Guys! <laughs> Extremely dark, check. Slightly stinky, check. Possibly very dangerous, check, check. T -t Twitch, the, the trolls might hear you. I definitely hear them. Huh? Over here. How are we doing on those tunnels? We are making good progress, Chief. One of them is nearly done. One is not enough! Tell them to dig faster! Yes, Chief. Chief? Chief? Come on, guys. Another tunnel, Paddle Pop, with more headroom, yeah! Spike! Twitch! <gasps> Paddle Pop! <laughs> Fancy that? A visiting lion! And he comes bearing gifts. Don't let go! I definitely don't want to be out of print! Okay, man! Come on! Pack 
Pack it in. This one's done. Dad, why don't we attack now? Stop whining. We'll get the signal soon, then we'll attack. Whoa! You gotta see this, Spike! my lion staff. I know, Paddle Pop. <sighs> and just when we found the coal, too. Yeah. There must be some way to get out. No. We toiled in this soil. Who ain't nothing but a sorry life in the dirt to show for it. <laughs> but now the time belongs to us. It is now our turn to take the treasure from this and all the other lands. <laughs> yes! yes! Paddle Pop, your lion staff. I see it, Twitch. The tunnels that will take us to the ends of the world are nearly complete. We have to work faster and harder to finish it. And when they are done, we will attack together and take everything. <laughs> Be ready. Paddle Pop. We were in one of the tunnels. Huh? It leads to the Lion Kingdom. And it didn't look good, my friend. We have to destroy these tunnels before it's too late. And I think I know how. Aye, a magical kind of coal, to be exact. Highly explosive. Just the kind I like. <laughs> but I have to get out of here first. Say hello to my little friend. Attaboy, Twitch. Give up your treasures! Over my dead body, you thieves and scallywags! If only I had me mayonnaise to man those cannons! I can man the cannons! <laughs> me Neighborhood chameleon coming through. <gasps> Why 
What's happening? Now, for the final act. The coal is haunted. Oh. Oh. Stay away from it. Oh. It must be a sign. Maybe we should stop digging. <sighs> Another captive audience. Stay here, Sonny. No. Not the light. Keep it away. Your pages, Mal. Promise I'll clean it later. There goes my mint condition. Oh. No. They need my help. But without the sun crystal. Oh. Another kingdom, Mal. Another kingdom in darkness, to be exact. Oh, do you get the feeling that it's hopeless? Yes, and I also get the feeling that somebody's watching us. <sighs> oh. Oh, oh, but aren't we supposed to light the coals? Yes, we are. Read it. In the darkness of the blackest night, send us a light that will give us might. A simple fire to guide our hopes alight. <laughs> now I just have to wait for the signal. Oh, that's a signal if I ever saw one. Here we go. All right, magic wand. Time to do your thing. Come on. for the moment, but without that coal from the ship. I know, Captain. We have to find Paddle Pop. I don't see Paddle Pop, Lena, but I definitely see something else.
heavens, too. <sighs> Couldn't have done it without you guys. Oh, my trusty magic wand. <laughs> right, Twitch. Let's head for the Sun Temple, Captain, so we can finally put an end to this darkness. Oi, oi, your highness, oi, oi. Pop will soon reach the Sun Temple Master to forge the Sun Crystal whole again in the fire of the Eternal Flame. Hmm. I see. But, but the Moon Crystal, it can protect us from the Sun Crystal. Is that why you don't seem troubled, Master? From the legends that you've told me, the Moon Crystal was defeated before. Yes, Master. In the hands of the Minotaur King. The Moon Crystal was defeated. But the Minotaur King is not my equal. He is but a creature of this pathetic world. A world that is inferior to mine. When the darkness is finally complete, I will have more power than I've ever had before. Then the Moon Crystal, in my hands, will also be infinitely more powerful. But for now, the Moon Crystal will simply be an irresistible treasure. Irresistible, Master? The Minotaur King had an army, didn't he? An army that almost defeated the forces of light. Yes! They escaped when the Moon Crystal was overcome and taken from them. Then they would probably want this back. Their treasure. All we need to do is... <laughs> I guess we didn't have to wait after all. Witches, I give you the Dark Warriors. <clears throat> give us back our crystal. The crystal belongs to the master, and soon, so will the rest of the land. Your king is long dead. I hold the crystal now. <clears throat> we have no need of a king, dead or alive. With that crystal, we will rule the land ourselves. Then try and take it! We are nearly there, Queen Shifa. The mountain fortress is but a stone's throw away. But has Paddlepop returned? You said that only the Sun Crystal can stop the darkness. Yes, the darkness may be almost complete, but I am certain that Paddlepop will soon find the Sun Crystal. We just need to stay alive, Your Highness. I'm sorry to say this, my friends, but it's not looking good. I know. Seems like someone turned off all the lights. Like a never-ending night. Never-ending, Twitch? If we don't get to that Sun Temple, it will be. I can only imagine how bad it is, Professor. Back in the Lion Kingdom, yes. Can't even entertain the thought, Battle Pop. With the future of the kingdom, 
and the rest of the world in the balance. All our hopes rest on these three broken pieces. Being forged again in the fires of the eternal flame. That's right, Prattle Pop. Are you sure you know where the Sun Temple is, Birdie? I don't remember you ever taking me there. Strangely enough, uh, I'm sure of it, Captain. As certain as I have ever been. As if I've longed to be there all my life. I don't think I've ever seen you so keen. I'd be doubting you no more, then. You mean you haven't seen every place in these lands, Captain? I reckon I have, but sometimes the obsession for those treasures clouds even my memories. Perhaps the eternal flame can light a fire in this here noggin. <laughs> that can wield the moon crystal like me. So there is one thing left for you to decide before the darkness is complete. Will you be fallen warriors to your own foolish desires or victorious generals for the eternal master of darkness? <laughs> What's wrong, Captain? Oh, it's not a good sign. I think we'd be running out of coal. And soon! Are we close to the Sun Temple, Sunny? I think so. I can feel it, Lena. <laughs> Don't worry, Paddle Pop. She's stronger than you think. What, Professor? Your mother, the Queen. She is stronger than you think. The year she spent in Shadow Master's prison, of course. The prison was difficult, yes. But there were harder things she had to endure. My lovely queen, how many years has it been? And how many times have I asked you, where is your son? Where is Paddle Pop? And how many times have I told you, I will never tell you where he is? If you tell me where Paddle Pop is, I promise that you will see him, touch him, Talk to him. 
Don't you miss him? Don't you want to see him? Your young son? The son you sent away to safety years ago. Never to see me again? Don't you miss me? Don't you want to see me again, mother? I love you, mother. Please. Where did I go? Tell him where I am, mother. Please. No! I will never tell you where he is. I would rather die than let you hurt my son. Then you will never, ever see him again! Your mother's time in prison was devastating, weakening her beyond her years. But throughout that dark time, she remained strong. Stronger than any captain, soldier, or knight. She remained strong because she yearned for only one thing. She yearned to keep you safe from all harm, whatever that cost to her life or her heart might be. I see it! I think I see it! Sun Temple up ahead! Am I right? That is the Sun Temple. Right, Sunny? You're right, Twitch. That's it. L L Lena, Paddle Pop, we're saved. We're saved, aren't we? Once we get there, the Sun Crystal will be whole again. That's right, Spike. Then we can stop the darkness. But Lena, if that is the Sun Temple, why is it so dark? Right. Whoa! Down below! The ocean of sand. Protector of the temple. P -p Pinch me if I'm dreaming, Twitch. Nope. It's not a dream, Spike. It's a nightmare. Sand sharks. Lots of them. Ha, don't you worry. That's what a flying pirate ship is for. That's right. We're just going to fly over the sharks and yonder to the temple. Whoa! to the yard arm. I might have spoken too soon. Oh. Ah! This is going to be a nightmare. Oh. Oh. Time for some oh. good old-fashioned sailing, me hearties. Whew. 
not bad for an old owl. There's too many of them. Lena, lassos. Get it up! Woo! A regular rodeo! You mentioned it. Maybe they're just hungry. A feeding spell? It's better than nothing, my friend. Read it. Delicious feasting fills our heads. Take away our cravings unfed. Forgive our stomachs for its starving chatter and help us feed its endless hunger. Good one, Spike. It's the sun crystal. Right, Professor. I know, Paddle Pop. Professor, isn't that the... Yes, Lena. 
It must be the sacred furnace where the sun crystal was forged. But the eternal flame is gone. <gasps> Thank you, sorceress. The darkness is affecting her more than the others. How can this be? She was exposed to the dark powers long before. Shadow Master's dark powers, to be exact. Shadow Master? A lord of darkness? Yes. Then this evil lord will surely get stronger as the darkness grows. But we have already defeated him, Sorceress. Paddlepop himself delivered the final blow. Then why do my senses tell me otherwise? <gasps> he is alive, Sorceress! I sensed a greater, darker power behind all this. Perhaps it is this Dark Lord himself. <gasps> Soldier! Captain! We see them! Get ready. A final stand is upon us. What, what, what does this mean, Twitch? This means the end, my friend. <sighs> Right, Mal. If we cannot forge these broken pieces, then we cannot stop the darkness. <sighs> we can only wait. Maybe we should try to find a way home, Paddle Pop, before the darkness is complete. It can't possibly end this way, Lena. We have to fight the darkness, with or without the crystal. I came from a world with eternal darkness, the source of my dark powers. <laughs> when this eclipse is complete, this world will go dark, and I will have absolute power. <laughs> and now, for my ultimate weapon! is gone, sorceress. Yes. If Paddle Pop is to find the Sun Crystal, it has to be soon, or all hope will be lost. If Paddle Pop is able to find the Sun Crystal, can he banish these creatures? And the darkness? That is correct, Captain. But to wield the Sun Crystal against the darkness, it comes with a price. A price? Sorceress? When my father, the Unicorn King, defeated the darkness with a crystal, it was a clash so great that it also took his own life. They're coming! Shadow Master will surely come to destroy the Sun Crystal soon. And with the darkness fully realized, he is sure to bring the dark creatures along with him. 
What are we going to do? All we have are broken crystal pieces. The answer may not be here, but we may yet find another way to forge the crystal. With my lion staff and all my strength, I will do everything I can to protect these pieces. And so will I. <gasps> Me too. Then together, we will protect these crystal pieces. But if defeat is inevitable, we will go to the ends of the world to keep them from falling into evil hands. Just like the sorceress and the wizard long before. Right. It's time to prepare. Our old enemy will soon be here. On my signal, Captain. You and the Professor unleash the power of those cannons. Onto the enemy? It'd be my pleasure. And mine too. Along with the Captain's cannons, the Sharks are sure to take out the front lines of their attack. That should help even the odds. Oh, right. But the rest of that army will be up to the three of us. Oh, no. Shadow Master! Enough. We'll find out soon, Twitch. I see Paddle Pop Master, but none of the light from the Sun Crystal. He must have failed to make it whole. <laughs> <laughs> this will be easy then. <laughs> and we have but one thing left to do. Attack! We may have never seen a battle like this, but they've never seen the fight we can bring. Huh. Right behind you. Pedal pop! Let him fly, Professor! Buccaneer? Nay! Everyone's got a little pirate in them! Strength! 
<laughs> Your end is near, Paddle Pop! Yes, we definitely could use some help. Whoop. Help! Read it, my friend, just like before. From Earth or Sky, we apply for help in times awry. Make haste the hands of magic to avert a cause that's tragic. Oh, not exactly the help we need. They're a little small, I would say. <gasps> oh, the wizard! Now that's about the right size. <laughs> Looks like you could use some help. Let's even the odds, brave knights! to the fortress, sorceress. They will overwhelm the whole mountain soon. Agreed, Captain. Your Highness, please. <sighs> when my father, the Unicorn King, defeated the darkness with a crystal, it was a clash so great that it also took his own life. <sighs> Queen Sheba, sorceress. You have to go back into the fortress. It's our last refuge. Protect the people at all costs. <sighs> of course. But I must protect my son before it's too late. <sighs> you found Paddle Pop before. Help me find him now. But your highness, you are weak and cannot possibly survive. Help me find my son. Please, help me save my son. Take her to the one that is brave and true. The one that can save us all. Thank you, sorceress. Join him. You made it just in time, wizard. I had to gather my fallen knights. The Dark Lord nearly destroyed us. But where is the crystal? The eternal flame is gone. We were not able to forge the crystal. We can't defeat the Dark Lord with the moon crystal in his hands. We have to find a way to forge the sun crystal.
Are you mine? We'll fight until the end. We'll fight until... Huh? Your torch is out, Captain. Woo! So is mine. How do we light these cannons? Simple fire. I think I can help with that. <laughs> one by one, they fall. We need to forge the crystal. We need to light the eternal flame. But how? I just always seem to find the brightest things. Somehow I'm attracted to them. Strangely enough, I I'm sure of it, Captain. As certain as I have ever been. As if I've longed to be there all my life. Sunny? Him! <laughs> In the darkest hour of our darkest night, send us the light that will give us might, a simple fire to set our hopes alight. Huh? Your spell didn't work. Where's the fire? Come to us, Paddle Pop. We'll face him together. Yeah, a fight they'll never forget. Just like the captain said. There's only one way to end this. Just like the legends long ago.
Lion strength! It's time to end the darkness. Mother! Paddle Pop! Mother. <laughs> Fear not, my son. As sure as the light will always find a way to fill the darkness. I will surely see you once again. <laughs> We did it!